Hey everybody, Rick Peterson here, Coast 11 Media. Now we are down interviewing David Zimmerman, co-owner of Seaside Pearl Winery. How's it going, David? Good. Good. Awesome. So uh, we're interrupting your work. You were hard at it when we came down here. Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> A little coffee break. So what were you doing? You were crushing grapes, right? Is that what this is? Yes. Uh, we're doing our cab south. So. Okay. And so the, basically you're, you're taking all the grapes out of these containers behind me here. Yeah. And then putting them up into there. Now it's going to get crushed. And I take it that the juice is going to get pumped into these blue bins. Correct. Uh, and then uh, into barrels from there. What do you do from there? Uh, well, uh, we'll, add, well, we add some different things to it. And then we'll cold soak them for a few days. Okay. And warm them up at the same time. And then get ready to put the yeast on them. And then we'll ferment. And some time after fermenting, we then squeeze the juice back off the skins, get it back into that machine. Okay, this one over here? Yeah, yeah. big machine over there. And then, uh, then, some, some barrels, yes. Awesome, okay, well listen, we're not gonna hold you up here, we'll let you get back to it, and uh, let's watch the process of what you're doing, uh, crushing the grapes. I'm just putting this stuff in because the next one I'll, I'll mix in pretty good. Back. Now, is this a proprietary secret? I think most guys do it. It's pretty fun. It smells like a wood shop. It smells good. It smells great. Yeah. yeah. It's an oak dust. I've never heard of doing that before. Okay, so, what do we have in, in the tank room here? Uh, well, we, we have uh, one tank completely full of Merlot, and the other one's about half full of uh, Syrah. And then we got some Gewurztraminer in here from Okinawa. Okay, and then there's a Pete Milo from here. And then we have um, some Muscat from Okinawa. Pinot Brie. Okay. We have um, some more Petit Milo uh, from here. We also have some um, Cap Wash in this tank that we're doing a rosé with. 